Hi, this is Brian Ship with Functionally Fit. In this call, I'm going to review a simple progression of a front plank exercise to improve hip abduction using a resistance band. A lot of times I want to work to increase hip strength while my clients learn how to maintain good postural stability, a nice neutral pillar position. So I'll put them into a forearm four plank position. And I'll get them in a good neutral spine alignment based on what they're able to achieve. Once we get in that position, we'll slowly reach out, tap, come back to midline, out, tap, back to midline. So they're staying engaged. They're working through a smaller range of motion based on the resistance as they maintain stability through that stance, hip and leg. A lot of times they'll want to rush, they get fatigued, but they just want to get through it. And you'll kind of see them sway and tap quickly. We want to resist that motion and have them be more stable. So encouraging them to move through less range of motion, maintaining a smoother, long cadence is much better in terms of getting high quality movement versus rushing through it, losing stability through the spine, having them compensate. And so again, if they're down, Nice and controlled, we move out, we tap, we move back in. Out, we tap, move back in. And it's as much about maintaining stability through that stationary leg and resisting motion as it is about achieving motion against the resistance of the band. So this is a really good way to target hip and core stability and improve postural alignment as they work in a fatigue state, I think you'll find to be an effective exercise, not only for strengthening, but also for injury prevention.